Um, so this is like a little exercise based on what I showed you last week, which was just you take your first finger and put it over the first and second strings, your second finger and put it on the second string at the sixth fret, your first finger is the fifth fret, and your third finger on the third string at the seventh fret. It's going to feel real scrunched up, but it's that Robert Johnson chord. <laughs> If you lift your middle finger off your second finger and let your first finger bar at the fifth fret, first and second strings, you get that. And it does feel weird, and you have to keep your slide up out of the way. And this is a good exercise because it's going to show you how to use your slide and get it out of the way. Okay? So let me play it for you. So two very simple slide things happening. In the first place, you're going fifth string, and then you're going to hit that chord twice. And then you're going to lift your middle finger off and hit that chord again. So you're going to go and then put your middle finger back on. Right? And then you're going to hit fifth string. You can take your slide and slide up to the fourth fret. And then you're going to immediately hit the third string. All right. So, so far. Okay. And then you're going to hit, of course, the fifth string again. And all you're doing there is making the chord again. And then lifting your middle finger off and barring at the fifth fret. Right. And then give it a little tut on. So... And then, because really, I mean, I want the G note, which I know can be found here. But because of where I'm playing, I'm going to move that G note up to the second string at the eighth fret. Right? Because that's a little easier than going. And then having to move the whole contraption again. This way you're going. That's the whole exercise. You do it over and over again, and you're going to end up getting a lot more out of your slide movement and out of your, and then you can add to it as well. Hey, folks, please drop me a comment and let me know where you're watching from. And if you like this content, please like and subscribe. And hey, thanks for watching.